How's it going everyone? My name is Mr. Boss of the Wind and welcome to another episode of some Black Ops 2. So the picture you're looking at right now and the video I'm going to be showing you in a second is some information that I've kind of gathered from a few sources through on YouTube and some research. Uh, of the newest zombies perk that's going to be in the game. So essentially every time that uh, Treyarch releases a zombies map, they typically add a new perk. Mob of the Dead, we saw Electric Cherry, and it looks like in Buried, we are going to be getting a perk that is going to be called Vulture Aid. Now, if you guys don't know, I like to play zombies like right when it comes out. I I'm not like a huge zombies player where I spend like five or six hours on every night, but I really do enjoy the experience when it first comes out. So it looks like the newest perk is going to be called Vulture Aid. And you can see it's kind of got like this vulture skull like uh, bird skull thing going on right there. Uh, kind of like a pelican or obviously like a scavenger bird that you would see. So that is very cool. And then of course the text on the outside kind of looks like Vulture Aid. And I've got a few theories on what this might be and how the perk might react because... We've seen a perk like this in the past Call of Duties before, and that has been Scavenger. So in a little bit, I'm going to bring you guys over to some multiplayer, and I'll really tell you guys what I'm talking about, and uh, honestly, how I think the perk is going to work. So let's get on with some multiplayer, and uh, I'll let you know what I think. Okay, so this is a game, I've got about three bots on the other team, and I'm just going to show you how Scavenger works. So I've got two flashbangs, and I've got two bouncing Bettys. Now I'm going to throw one of them right now, so that would empty out one. And I'm now going to throw the Bouncing Betty, so that is another emptied. So now I only have one. Now if I go over here and kill this bot who is running towards me and has no chance of killing me, if I pick up that blue scavenger pack, I will get one back. And uh, that is the theory I have for the zombies, is that when you waste an equipment or claymores or Bouncing Bettys that you can pick up off the wall, that you will be able to get one of them back via a scavenger pickup. You can see I have none, and now I have one. The only problem with this, though, is in multiplayer, you are able to do this for one enemy, meaning every enemy you kill you'll get a scavenger bag. But in zombies there are way more enemies and that would seem unfair to almost have unlimited ammo. So I'm really torn on what my theory is. Are you going to get this quote unquote scavenger bag only when you kill a, a major boss or a, um, you know, kind of like how there was the, uh, the warden in Mob of the Dead where you get one if you kill him? Because then that would make it very rewarding for killing someone like that instead of running away from him. So that is my theory, guys. Um, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Now, I'm pretty interested to know what you think about this because uh, all the new perks are awesome. Uh, in fact, to my right, like on a shelf, I have all the zombies perks and like replica bottles that's how cool i think these little perks are so uh anyways guys yeah my name is mr boss the wind thanks for checking out this video hope you have a great day be sure to like and subscribe of course i'll talk to you guys in the next video